guys, today I'm going to be taking you through the process we use to wrap our eggs um, that are going to be travelling um, across the country through the post. Um, so the aim is to wrap them up nice and tight um, so they arrive all in one piece um, at the other side. First step to do is to pick um, your nicest eggs, freshest eggs, make sure they don't have any small cracks, um, any really dirty eggs you don't want to use, um, or the shapen eggs we don't want to use. Um, so we've got a selection of eggs here um, that we pick from. Once um, we have selected our eggs, we start adding a layer of tissue paper um, to the bottom of the eggs just so that they sit firmly in that egg carton. Next, we add a layer of padding to the top of the egg carton lid, um, which is just shredded paper added um, to a tissue to hold it all in. Um, and then we close the lid. I gently flip over the carton to make sure there is um, no wobbling of the eggs. If there is, I will reopen the carton and fix that issue. Next, we add sticky tape um, around both sides of the egg carton, just as an added measure to make sure it doesn't open unexpectedly. Now that the eggs themselves are wrapped, um, we can make the box that they are to be posted in. Um, this is a nice, strong, sturdy cardboard that usually does the trick very well. Time to add some padding to the bottom of the box, um, which the egg carton will sit on top. And then it's time to place the egg carton on top of that. Next, we start placing um, the shredded paper in between the egg carton and the side of the box, making sure to push it down firmly um, just to fill those little gaps and make sure the egg carton itself can't move around in the box while in transit. Finally, we add one more layer of padding to the top of the egg carton to fill the gap between the carton and the top of the box. Lastly, I leave a note on top of the shredded paper just explaining some basics on how to start incubating your purchased eggs. Time to close up that box and sticky tape it all together. Job well done. Now it's just a matter of putting the box into a red bag, labelling it with the address and putting a tracking number on it. Now that we've finished um, wrapping the eggs and putting them in the postage bag, all that's left to do is add a tracking number and the address and then they are ready to go. Thanks for watching everyone.